Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and in today's one we have the Monaco Grand Prix I just want to say before we get into anything at the end of episode 5 it did say Spanish Grand Prix I did do the Spanish Grand Prix and when I went to record it at the end because I'm obviously on PS4 um, I pressed it but it only recorded a minute and like 40 seconds or something so I don't know what happened there I really don't know what happened there but um, I will show you the standings and season results as you can see uh, it says ESP and it says 18th so we went from 11, 19, 11, 10, 9, 18th still on 3 points um, I don't know why like I said I don't know why my recording messed up but we have the hardest race of all I think of the Monaco Grand Prix where you can't really overtake anyone on anything but let's try and do what we can uh, I'll advance the time now and then get to the Monaco Grand Prix practice do the uh, track acclimatization ERS management and quality pace and then obviously do the qualifying itself so I'll advance the time now and get to the Monaco Grand Prix practice and we are at the Monaco track for practice the track uh, track acclimatization, then ERS and quality pace. Um, so let's get to track acclimatization first, then ERS and then quality pace. Next up, obviously, is track acclimatization. So let's get to track acclimatization now. And we are out for track acclimatization for the Monaco circuit. Now I don't really like this track like to drive on but I like it in real life because it is a really really good and we are oh no I didn't want to do that one to just flashback um, obviously get to a bit where it starts and play from there this track obviously don't like because it's very tight like that it's a very tight circuit so pretty much wait what how did I fail that corner How did I like fail that corner? Unless I went through it too slow. I'm not bothered if I get a green. I'll take a green at this stage. I'm not really bothered. Yeah. I don't know why it says reset to track because I don't have that as a setting anymore. Unless I do, but we'll start it from here. Yeah, I don't know why that's happened like that. The turning pretty much isn't that good. I don't know why, but oh well. Like I said, I'll take a green. I'm not gonna be bothered with a green. Wait, why? Body, body, body. Start from there. There we go, that's better. Like I say, if we get a green first one, I'm not bothered. I'll just keep it as a green. Yeah. How I'm definitely not taking two reds. Definitely not taking two reds. I will be taking two reds there. I'll be taking one red there. 
I don't know why I took two fucking reds there, but doesn't matter. <sighs> this track is going to be the bane of my life. I hate this track. I hate this track, but it doesn't matter. I'll take a green. I'm not even gonna get a green, am I? Seems like we're a bit slow in these corners. Turn 15, turn 16, turn 19. I'll try my best at trying to get a green because I failed it. It doesn't help when you're having to do all you can on a small track. Because it's so tight. Like it's, it's literally such a tight track. How are you meant to do that corner? Like, how are you meant to do that corner so good? Honestly. Oh, bonnet. Oh, bonnet, I don't care. Oh, bonnet, I don't care. But this, I'm sorry, is pathetic. That corner, how are you meant to get that, path that perfect? How are you meant to get that corner so perfect? I'm confused. That I'll take. I have to take that, but doesn't matter. I missed that one, so we're gonna run that back and hopefully get a better corner. We'll start it from here. Start it from here. had to break then. I'm not bothered. A green's a green for me. Yeah, missed that one. We have a green, I'm not doing anything else, I'm just gonna get to track a uh, ERS management now. And we are out for ERS management, um, let's see if we can do anything better and see what we can do. Um, see what we can do with ERS management, hopefully we can get it first go I'm already behind Del Pace I'm definitely not gonna get this done straight away first time because I need to get the target time and yeah <sighs> um, I'm just gonna start it back from here I'm not really that bothered. That's a better corner. That's not a bad corner either. I lost a minute on that corner, you mad? Sorry, I'm going to just do ERS here and use it, turn it off now. Tell me, I don't know how you meant to get a 1 minute 
16 are on this track. Quality pace ain't going to be that good. Quality pace is definitely not going to be good. I don't care. And we are out for quality pace. Um, in practice, I pretty much think um, I pretty much think we are not gonna we are not gonna achieve a one minute fourteen for quality pace, and I don't think we will achieve it. But we could do. But I'm not saying we are going to with this track because this track is very very tough. I'm already four tenths down, so I'm definitely not going to get it. Like, how they think, yeah, you're going to get around that corner very quickly is beyond me. I'm already three seconds down on my lap time. So somewhere I'm going to have to claw out three seconds from somewhere, but I don't think I can. And I'm already fucking... Ah, oh, fuck it, I don't care. My wing's been damaged, I don't care. Ah, it's been damaged even more. wing isn't damaged now but I can assure I can assure you I'm definitely not getting this uh, quality pace done so let's uh, see no, I don't care I don't care uh, good day today uh, let's have a look how did you feel competition is this season? It's been great, all the drivers are at their best this year. It's not close as I like it. I love the ch it's not as close as I like it. I love the ch I love a challenge. Uh We'll do that one and get my claim up. Yeah, that's some body work out on track. We're struggling for great it's nothing that won't buff out. The car just wasn't right. I think we need to go back to the drawing board. That one. Get my claim up again. Great. Well, that's everything. You're welcome. And we are ready for qualifying here in Monaco. So let's uh, just see short qualifying. Sun, sun, sun. It's nice and nice. Let's get out on track and get to qualifying. And we are ready for qualifying here at the Monaco track. Let's hope we can qualify somewhere good. I don't like this track as I've said because it's too too short and very very tight going around corners. Like I can't I don't really wanna put it into words how I feel about this track, but it really annoys me. Like how are you meant to do this this next corner that's coming up not this one the next one very fast is very stupid unless they want you to like do something like that and qualify good that's a bit stupid Max Verstappen has pulled out the first fastest lap but I'm gonna have to flashback that because I don't really want to damage my wing see how slow I went around that corner right, we'll run it back from here right, and then we'll get on the throttle through the tunnel back out of the tunnel and around this corner 
Let's see what we can do, what time we can pull out. I'm not bothered where I qualify, to be honest. As long as it's somewhere that's respectable. Yep. Definitely not using, uh, losing a front wing. Well. I would just be glad when I get this track out of the way because it is the hardest. Run it back from here. And pretty much come to a halt straight away. And we're going to qualify in sixth. But we will get back to the garage and obviously if I need to come out again, I will do it again. And I'm back out for a qualifying lap um, because we are down in 22nd. Reset to track. Why is that coming up all of a sudden resetting to track? I don't want to reset to track. I need to turn that off. And we'll run it back from here. But we just need to... Do well going around corners. Hopefully... Hopefully we can pull out a good, good time. Hopefully, I'm saying hopefully, but I just want to have a good time to that is respectable. I just want a respectable time that is respectable for this track and for my team. Right. Nope, not losing a front wing like that. I'll run it back from here. Ah, that's better. That is better as well. So I'm getting a better feel for the car now. I'm a full minute in front of my delta for my first lap. Which is good at uh, full minute, a full second, show it. Now we're eight tenths up, nine, oh, 1.1. 1 .1. That was a better corner from the first lap. This is going to be a better, better time. Hopefully. Two minute, uh, two seconds up. 2.2, 2.1 2 and we qualified wait, what? we're qualifying in 20 seconds somehow and it is race day here in Monaco for the Monaco Grand Prix at Monte Carlo track um, let's see where we're going to finish we did qualify in 22nd um, but I'd rather qualify low anywhere at this track because this track is very very hard anyway so let's get to the track and get to racing and here we are lining up on the grid ready for the Monte, Car Monte Carlo uh, Grand Prix here in Monaco well, like I say we did qualify in 22nd but I'm not bothered so let's get to the race now and see where we can finish And put a ERS and have a rich lap first. Um, nope. Instant flashback because of what I've just done. Being stupid. And I'll start back from here and I'll literally have to. No, 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 no. Carla Sainz down in 20th. It's not where you really want to see Carla Sainz. I've moved up a place and that's it. And that is pretty much 
Nope, nope. Yep. Uh, that corner is pretty stupid anyway. Let's check your MFD for a new see what we get. Wait, what? Why? Did I clip something? A new strategy is available on the MFD. All right. Confirm. Copy that. Oh yeah. I'm already last. Yeah. I pretty much don't like this track. Like I said in qualifying and all that lot and yeah it's gonna be a tough one yet the downforce I can't do much so I'm just gonna hope have to hope that and a safety car comes out at some point yeah I'm just gonna have to limp home in And pretty much just I need to I'm not bothered I'll just have to take what I can I just have to take what I can I'm not bothered I have to change my front wing because I need down force um, so I'll just have to change my wing get my down force back and I would say my wheels my tyres have been changed now, so hopefully I should be fine. Let's get on a rich, rich lap. I'm 27 seconds behind. Um, so I need to put in some flying laps. I'm just go on a rich out lap, and then obviously turn rich off oh I don't care oh for god's sake and run it back from here how they expect you to do fastest laps qualifying and fastest laps on this track is beyond me but doesn't matter we're 30 seconds away um no 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 this track is very very tough it's pretty tough so let's run it back from there take that corner a bit too deep they're already coming down the other side. I'm not bothered. But let's just carry on, com concentrate on our own race, and just pretty much not do anything stupid. And now we will turn Rich off and go on to standard. I mean, there's pretty much no point in me having DRS on anyway, because I'm 30 seconds behind every single car. So, I don't really need DRS, do I? But, how do they expect you to get that corner bang on? is pretty mad but turn ERS off anyway because I don't need it on <laughs> so let's oh no ah pretty I hate this track so much I hate it with a passion I hate it with a passion 
imagine doing this in real life like pretty much is stupid oh nope if I crash out badly I'm just gonna let it happen um, I'm just literally gonna let it happen so we're running back from here I'm not bothered about that just have to lift half and do some testing for the team and I'm not bothered no like I, like I said um, if if um, obviously I do crash out and it is a bad crash then I will leave the crash in and that will obviously be at the end of the race but I just don't want to lose a wing a bit of my wing and have a lack of downforce which I need around this track going round corners so I just have to I ha literally have to let it roll around that corner without putting no throttle on whatsoever but to be fair I might just literally no I'm not losing a bit of my wing this track is really really annoying it literally is really really tough I think it's gonna be the point where I just where I just want to crash out on purpose but at the same time where I don't yep again from wing I am I do apologize guys for doing this so many times I just don't want to lose a front wing I really don't I really don't want to lose a front wing but I really don't and I'm not bothered I might end up losing control of the car anyway going around the corner with no downforce but there's no point so might as well just use overtake button right I'm not really that bothered I'm literally twenty second. Engine is looking a little warm. I'm literally. I'm literally not racing anyone. See, I just have to let it course round, which is very stupid, and I'm thirty six seconds behind. Nicholas Latifa and 38 seconds behind Carl Sainz. Um, this track is so, so hard. It literally is so hard. I, I might just cut out some laps anyway. Because there is 20. And I don't really want to bore you with. 20 laps of me doing this. Why? I don't want to reset to track. Alright, so. Run it back for me. Uh, early braking to get around the corner. I don't know when their pit windows are. I'm not really that bothered. I, I honestly couldn't care. Like, this track 
is so annoying, mental, mentally draining. It literally is a really tough race. Like, I can't put into words. This track is physically annoying. Like, makes me wanna scream because I keep losing my front wing and like I say I need front wing for downforce going around corners and I'm just gonna have to go from here because this is where I lost the front plate anyway fails in the pits I'm not gonna catch back up to anyone at this point at this point so that th there's no point I either need a uh, really I need what do you mean I ain't got oh, uh, ER, uh, ERS open or on that was a good corner but everyone's pitted anyway so they're gonna be at least what still 30 seconds in front like, I'm not pulling out any time, but hopefully we can do something and just not mess up. And pretty much we are following the safety car and I need to redo that corner and... Pretty much, if you do qualify in last, your, pr your race is pretty much poor because you're dead last. Why do I have to stay behind Ricardo if I'm 22nd? Can I not unlock myself? I can't help falling too far back, you know. Why can't I not take over Ricardo? I want to unlap myself. Even though I'm in 22nd. Okay, nope. Why? There's no point in me fucking racing. I'm literally dead last. And pretty much behind the guy who's in 7th. So there's no point. Like, there's literally legit no point. There's, there's legit no point. Because I'm going to have to let everyone go past me anyway. See? There's no fucking point anyway. Do you know what? Fuck it. I might as well just let every single fucker go past me. And do it like that. There's four laps of fuel remaining. Fuck it. I'll go on a rich. There's four laps of four fewer men. I'm not bothered. <sighs> this track is really, really tough. Really tough. It's really tough. I'd be glad when this track is 
over and I get to the next track, which will be good. Fuel information. There's three laps of fuel remaining. Three. Now we come off rich and go to standard. Fuck it. Yeah, corner cutting. Yeah, no. I'm gonna have to let these pass anyway. I'm a full lap behind anyway. But don't matter. It doesn't matter. If it comes up saying Billy Flag then I have to let him pass one not I mean, I can't let him pass on a corner, can I? Blue flag, blue flag. Yes, I know. We're not racing the car behind. Let them pass when you can. So, Samson has won the Monte Carlo Grand Prix here in Monaco. I am here down in 19th, uh, 21st, no not even 21st, 22nd, I'm on lap 19. I'll probably complete this lap and the race will end because there's no point anyway. I'll go around a sec another time. So that was... A really, really tough, tough race for us. Pretty much if you don't qualify in a good position. Um, so Mercedes have won it, and what a great race it was. So if you don't qualify in a good position, then... Um, your race is pretty much gone and messed up anyway if you qualify last um, so let's see the podium celebrations and then get back to the main screen next <coughs> Here are the podium celebrations. Hamilton wins with Valtteri Bottas second, and then I think it was Sebastian Vettel in third. If not, it was um, Charles Leclerc came in third. Sorry, it wasn't Sebastian Vettel. Um, our race was very tough. Qualifying in twenty second, uh, I'm finishing. And finishing in 22nd, Jack qualified in 20th, finished 16th, which is good for him. Uh, let's have a look at the driver's standings. Um, we're in 15th with 3 points, 108 points behind uh, the top points. Um, constructors, we're down in ninth behind Alfa Tauri and uh, Alfa Romeo, but in front of Haas and Williams. Um, let's get back to the main menu. There probably might be uh, some interview questions. If there is any interview questions, uh, they will be included. So let's get to the main menu or the interview questions. So we are back to the main menu. There were no interview questions or, well, she didn't answer, asked me any questions, so I didn't need to do anything. Uh, as you can see in the bottom left, Azerbaijan Grand Prix is next. We'll do that next episode, but we will apply some 
weight training for him and we'll do that we'll do this I think we'll do that one and then this one that one so they're all the things that we need to do before the Azerbaijan Grand Prix in the next episode um, I'm gonna just put some things on the R&D tree I'm gonna develop this um, not that although I would like to although to be fair I think I'm actually gonna do it because why not so let's get some more things done for the aerodynamics next when we get some more acclaim uh, um, some po uh, more R&D points um, but for now I think we're going to have to put that on no penalty um, we'll put that one on for now gearbox is fine so everything's fine and obviously we're down in 15th like I said anyway um, so yeah that is it for episode 6 I did say at the start that I did film the Spanish Grand Prix but it didn't film it only filmed that I only recorded that one minute 40 seconds or something so I don't know why that did that but um, I hope you all enjoyed this episode if you have make sure you smash the like button on the video I hope you've all enjoyed this like I just said like subscribe and peace